you talk about tunnel vision. You've already lost James Harden. You've already lost Kevin Durant. You don't have the self-awareness, which has always been my critique of Westbrook, to recruit. It's not, it's, it's not cool. Hey, man, I'm too cool to recruit. You do get the best recruiter in NBA history is Pat Riley. The best recruiter in college basketball is John Calipari. The best recruiter in college football is Nick Saban. You do realize if there's a woman that you want to marry, she's beautiful and smart, she has options, you better show her the love, brah. you got to be kidding me. This is Derrick Rose and Russell Westbrook. Remember Derrick Rose? I'm not going to call LeBron. What did LeBron say? I am. I'm going to call Chris Bosh, Shane Battier, Ray Allen, Dwayne Wade. But you're too cool. So now figure this out now with Paul George. Paul George is going to be recruited between Magic Johnson, the most charismatic player in league history in L.A., and Russell Westbrook. No, nah, man, I'm not recruiting him in Oklahoma City. Who do you think is going to get Paul George? The Lakers started their recruiting last night. They put the family front row. Validate your parking. More to drink. More to eat. Can we give you gifts? I bet you they got swag bags when they left. Of course you do that. I talked to Mark Rick, the coach of the Miami Hurricanes, one time. I said, what's recruiting about? He said, it's about love. John Calipari told me the same thing. you got to show these players, man. It's not just about NBA. I got your back. I got your brother's back. I got your mom's back. I got your dad's back. I'm going to change your life. I'm into you. I'm going to make your life better. Sorry, you're too cool to do that. You're too cool to recruit Derrick Rose and Russell Westbrook. LeBron's done it. Pat Riley's done it. The Warriors, six months before they took Kevin Durant from Russell Westbrook, they did it. And you know why they did it? Because people who are great, and great is very rare, have options. That beautiful woman you're falling in love with, she's got options, brah. The cool thing ain't going to work. you got to show her the love. And that tail back in Texas and that Paul George in Oklahoma City. Dude, there are people lining up for him. LeBron's going to get on the phone. But, man, I'm too cool here in Oklahoma City. I'm sure he'll want to stay for me and the Applebee's down the street. you got to be kidding me. I tell you all the time, folks. The legends in this league are legends not just because of talent. They're legends because of self-awareness. Magic Johnson's one of the smartest players in league history. LeBron's one of the smartest players in league history. Steph Curry's like, I'll take fewer shots. Hell yeah, I want to play with Kevin Durant. Oh, I saw this morning, this morning I, I found this, this interesting story about, about James Harden. Have you seen the story about James Harden? He said, yeah, I knew Chris Paul wasn't happy with the Clippers. I knew it in the summertime, and I knew he was a free agent, and I wanted to see where his head was. He didn't seem happy, so uh, we just took it from there and started recruiting him. Hey, man, but congrats on being cool, but she's got choices. Come back, come, congrats on being cool with a high school quarterback, but he's got 13 colleges after. How do you think great bands are formed, great movies are formed, great companies are formed, great dynasties are formed with love, with knock, 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 ring, ring, ring. Dude, we need you. We need you. We're good. We want to be great. That's what bands do. That's what movie directors do. That's what agents do. That's what Magic does. That's what Saban does. That's what Calipari does. That's what LeBron's been doing. You're in Oklahoma City. You're already at a major disadvantage. L.A. and Magic or Too Cool for School Russell and Applebee's. You're just giving Paul George the Lakers. You're going down without a fight. And to do this when you've already lost KD, like you, it, it's one thing if you're just naive. Russell Westbrook's not naive. He's been in this league now for how long? He's already had two guys, two superstars pulled from him. And he doesn't have the self-awareness. Like, if you've lost the girl of your dreams twice, by the third time, if you don't understand the urgency to make the sales pitch, then it's on you. you got to be kidding me. No, I'm not going to do a sales pitch. You know, it's all about titles. Then you're dumb. Sorry, but you're not smart enough.